Lagos, the economic hub of Nigeria, and one of the fastest growing cities in Africa, this is the largest metropolitan city in southwestern Nigeria, with a population of over 21 million inhabitants. Lagos was the capital of Nigeria until the government decided to move its capital to Abuja in December 1991. The city has a significant influence on commerce, entertainment, technology, education, politics, tourism, arts, and fashion in Africa. The mega city has the fourth highest GDP in Africa and has one of the largest and the busiest seaports on the continent due to the large urban population and port traffic volume. Lagos is classified a medium port mega city. This video is sponsored by Speak Light Institute. This complaint basically trains students in foreign languages such as French, German and the likes and also prepares students for the challenge ahead. Traveling to a country speaking a different language is a challenging endeavor, discouraging many people from exploring the world and taking opportunity therein. Some German-speaking countries offer free education and low tuition fee for international students such as Germany, Austria, Switzerland, Luxembourg, and so on. In Germany, some schools offer 100% free tuition fee for international students, both undergraduates, masters, and PhD. In Austria, some schools offer very low tuition fee, such as 350 euros to 700 euros, depending on the school. In Switzerland, University of Zurich offer tuition fee as low as 500 euros for master's program, 100 euros for undergraduate per semester. To enroll for these universities, you need a German language certification, which Speak Right Institute has brought to you. They offer both online and offline programs. Do well to reach them on the phone number on your screen. The Lagos State Government has done so many projects in different sectors of the state, from sanitation to transportation to healthcare and so on. Today we'll be exploring the intervention of different government projects in Lagos State. Sanitation. This is the process of keeping a place free from death, infection, diseases, and so on by removing waste, trash, and garbage. Recently, the Lagos State Government has dedicated its time in cleaning the city. The metric for the most polluted city is determined using factors such as air and water pollution, garbage disposal, noise pollution, cleanliness, amongst others. The commercial center of Nigeria, Lagos, is the second most polluted city in Africa after Cairo. In a bid to reduce and eradicate all forms of pollution in the state, the Lagos State Government started tackling this issue from different points. On the 20th of July 2024, the Lagos State Government started its awareness campaign by visiting different areas of the state every single week to educate, sensitize, and make residents know the importance of proper waste disposal. So for us to use this as an enlightenment and an awareness campaign, given what we have seen, Given the drive round we have seen today, it's rather very appalling and it's totally unacceptable the level of environmental nuisance that we have constituted as a people. The Lagos State Government started a sanitation advocacy campaign from Suru Under Bridge to Alapare Market in Moshin to Alama to Market along Agege Motor Road to Lasu Yanoba Road, to Barigal LCDA, to Lagos Ibadan Expressway, and so on. The Lagos State Government also emphasizes the importance of good sanitation practice amongst all residents of the state in order to ensure a clean, flood-free, and sustainable environment across the state, encouraging the residents of Lagos State to collaborate with the state government to ensure that Lagos State is free from garbage. But some residents of Lagos State are fond of putting their waste by the roadside, which is bad, and the Lagos State Government has kicked against it. Good morning. It's going to take that to that you drop me. Carry that your 
carry that thing where you put here. Carry and go back to your house. Your house. If you bring that come there again, they will carry you. Don't come here to come and put your refuse again. Don't put your refuse on the floor again here. Go on, go on, go and give it to your PSP. It's not free. Where do you want to Where do you stay? You stay along this road and you don't have PSP. You don't have their contact. You cannot call them. You have to go and rearrange yourself with them. I think it's not, it's not free, so you don't have the right to come and put it here. Just come here. Is that place your refuse go? So why do you have to bring your refuse from your house down to the main road? Who said so? Who? Eh? One woman. Where is your mom? So, and I'm talking to you. You, you are just walking away. So, you let me call up Billy Sibany. Any soul, and let me call up Billy Sibany. Any bit in Dallas, indeed. Don't they? Hey, so, Loma. So, that then, so, Loma, kill the tears, she'd be left for Loma. Any so request on the mobile law when you come And so will Loma. So, I want Loma to one billion PSP to one billion kilo de tech billet for you. Talo one in charge. So, go learn some OC. Receive the things on order. A man so come on, will he? And so will Loma. So, show on PSP one billion in the ship billet sister. Nibble a man cool and you see no. Nibble and cool see. No, can I that? He can't tell me. She will judge you more than that. She can't make me like daddy. No, can't make me daddy. No, judge you more. But you are also also magic. The PSP, but you say to be loyal, you know. And she no can't hear. Oh yeah, one of them soon. One of them. So second one that you brought before, you know. Is that the two? Eh? You said? Oh yeah, people can say. Now, some of the Lagos State Waste Management officials has not taken it upon themselves to resist residents from dropping waste by the roadside. I think the Lagos State Government should provide waste bin at every junction for easy disposal of waste.